what I have to say is, se ve, se siente, el amor está presente. Stacy and Sara and all the performers, Bomberas and Sherry Marag and everybody, I really, really feel it deep inside. And um, also, there are some people that came from uh, Laredo, Texas, Rosie de Anda, Ricardo de Anda, uh, Juan Garza from Los Angeles, Claudine Norcher from Mexico. Mm. So I'm, I'm very humbled that these people uh, made the track to, to be here tonight. You know, uh, uh, Vic Salina said, this is so wonderful, you should get evicted more often. <laughs> <laughs> Just like that. <laughs> so, um, so what... Uh, one thing I, I do want to point out, I, I've been in this city, I've been in the mansion for a long time. And uh, one thing I, I do want to point out that back in the day when the, the BART first got to the mission, there was a mission coalition got together to resist redevelopment. And I have to point out what happened to the Fillmore. The Fillmore had a lot of soul. I used to go to Minis Can Do, they had great blues, great jazz, great culture, great artists. And Rita Bellman went in there and sucked the soul out of the film, or they sucked the soul out of the Western edition, and now it's Hayes Valley. So, uh, we have to resist. Um, so, and, and one of the resistance uh, thing that, uh, interventions, Mia Galvis from Encantada Gallery got evicted. On November 2nd, she's going to set up a pop-up shop in front of the place she got evicted. That place is how angry. I want everybody to go support Mia Galvis. Because Mia Galvis was, she started Balmi Alley. Mm -hmm. She had Encantada Gallery, and it was a place where I got my milagros and uh, my things for my altar. So it's very important to uh, support me. So November 2nd, on Valencia Street, in front of her old place. So, um, so another thing I'd like to point out that the Galeria worked for 17 years on 24th and Bryant. And a lot of things were born there. Um, Asco from Los Angeles, Harry Gamboa, Marisela Norte, Frank. They came and they had a lot of influence, not only in the mission, but throughout the city. Their performance and interventions that they did set a precedent. So, um, and also Guillermo Gomez Peña, Culture Clash, Marga Gomez, Manica Palacio, and uh, I do want to give a shout out to Jose Antonio Burciaga. He was a very <laughs> so, um, also produced a play called Stages, and a lot of people came together, and one of those persons that came was Jose Montoya from the Royal Chicano Air Force. He was part of the stages and uh, he sang the Dirt Lake Doll Dog and Look Like Cadillac. And he had a, a lot of profound influence. His Chicanismo was art with social activism and it had a lot of influence. So, um, um, I want you to think about Jose Montoya and all the wonderful things he has done for the Chicano movement. And I got to meet Richard through his father. 
And um, also, um, I want to invite everybody tomorrow. I'm going to be at Solmart's Cultural Center between 11 and 3. I want to invite everybody. It's at 934 Brandon. Uh, my son Ray and I work together. And we put our heart and soul into this one particular exhibit, uh, Imagining Time, Gathering Memory. And uh, every placement that we put together, the artist, it's, it's uh, profound, it has significance. And again, I'm talking about ritual, and I'm talking about uh, a deep spiritual uh, gathering of artists, so I invite you to come down tomorrow. I will we'll be there and I'll greet you, so everybody's welcome. Um, there's a lot I could say about my eviction. Um, I've been there for 35 years, and the thing that's happening to the city, uh, it's happening to the mission, is sort of the supervisors, Lyndon Bree and the rest of the supervisors got millions of dollars from developers and uh, real estate people weaken the rent control laws and we're seeing artists, families, uh, the Latino population being decimated, the black population being decimated in this city. So we have to resist. Uh, back in the days of the Mission Coalition, people got together and resisted. We have to find that source again. And again, I want to thank you so much for being here. Uh, I really feel all the support and love from this community, and I thank you so much. And with that, um, I would like to introduce some uh, dear friends of mine, we started on 24th and Bryant, uh, 1984, and this group is called Culture Clash. Thank you. Las Bomberas de la Bahía, give it up.